Welcome. If you have been experiencing spiritual chills on your journey, then this video is for you. Spiritual chills defines when you get goosebumps from positive outside or internal stimuli, which could be memories, compliments, inspiring music, movies, a loved one, time with friends, praying, praising God, meditation, receiving a confirmation, feeling motivated to strive, gratefulness, and most importantly feel a cold or odd euphoric slash blissful wave flowing underneath your skin. This euphoric wave can be learned to be brought up on demand consciously for long durations without the physical reaction of goosebumps and can give one the ability to do incredible feats with it. This video will be about if you should in your when getting spiritual chills. One of the easiest ways anyone can notice this occurrence trying to happen is during inspiring slash touching slash moving movie scenes or songs. Those and a few other ways can be enough to activate your spiritual energy. New message from Reddit user Darwin Fish. Would you like to play it? Yes. Calling something spiritual doesn't mean anything. It is an equivalent of saying, I have no idea what this is, so I will make up a word to describe it. Unless you have a preparatory to that at the back of the the woo woo, dress and go off, it is just fiction. There is no consciousness separate from the body. There is no spiritual energy separate from the body. If you have evidence of that, I would be fascinated to read it. But later recording, historical, and you ain't got it. Are you sure you want to block user Darwin Fish? They won't be able to view your profile, posts or comments. Yes. The author of this comment has been blocked. But those who are unaware of the occurrence and just not that in tune or aware of what is happening on an energetic level inside of their body will ignore it or just resist the overwhelming flow of euphoric energy that can be unleashed once they let go of all resistance. Resisting to it would have you feel it like water brought up to a boiling point in one specific location of your body, sometimes hot or cold depending on one's affinity. This feeling that almost seems like condensed energy being activated should not be held down but rather allowed to be set free. Once you do so, you can start to analyze it then and eventually learn to summon it on your own without any outside stimuli. Or you can become aware of what exactly is a good trigger for you or what values do you really hold dear. For example, with a movie scene about a hero defeating a villain, which then points out to you that justice is something that your true self really values are the same with an inspiring lyric from a song. Other reasons why not to ignore it are Accepting it helps you become aware of your spiritual body and energy in general or allowing you to become open to people who you hold a connection with or would want one with. And finally, it helping you start your spiritual journey by becoming conscious of your spiritual energy. So to conclude, one should not hold down this energy when it comes true. At first, it might seem like a really emotional occurrence, but if you do accept it, it will give you the keys to open the door to your spiritual side. Thank you for watching this video and tune in next week for videos going more in depth on what you can do, how to strengthen it, how to feel it, and much more on spiritual chills.